this is sort of, this is a really rare kind of thing. It's the kind of thing that you see in Rusty's collection. Virgil Finley, uh, admittedly one of the greatest of all the science fiction and fantasy illustrators. Virgil Finley at one point was contracted, and this was after the success of Hollywood's uh, 30s version of Midsummer Night's Dream that had uh, almost all of the big names in Hollywood in little cameo roles throughout the movie. Well, the movie was a big success, and on the strength of that, uh, I can't remember who the, the publisher was. They wanted, it might have been Gernsback, they wanted to put out uh, like a, a, a an illustrated version of the Summer Night's Dream. And I think that the idea was almost that it would that it would be uh, as many illustrations as, as, as text, a lot of illustrations. And the project was begun but never completed. Well, Virgil Finley went ahead and did the illustrations. And so you have all of these illustrations that would have accompanied that version. And you see a lot of the hallmarks of Finley's style. Things like this pointillism and his his use of different, putting dots in different spaces from each other, almost like Ben Day dots, and uh, shadows, creating shadows and faces. And it gives him an, an incredible uh, richness and depth of representation that way, getting really, really close to photorealism. Yeah. And lots of things like this throughout the Hevelin collection. Uh, Rusty was really partial to, to the illustrators, and so there are many collections of Hannes Bach's work, collections of Virgil Finley's work. And then as time goes by and we get into the, the 50s and the 60s, William Rotzler and uh, quite a number of other fan artists, uh, all represented throughout the collection in, in beautiful little collections like this. Uh, Von Bodie. Uh, the underground comic, mm -hmm. uh, lots and lots of collections of his drawings. Frank Frazetta, the, uh, the famous Conan and, and fantasy illustrator. There is no, there's almost no part of science fiction or fantasy that Rusty didn't connect with on some level. Got some other really great scenes.